Welcome, folks, to what promises to be a great Tuesday night of the NBA on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan. With me tonight, Craig Anthony and Richard Jefferson. And reporting from the sidelines all game long, we've got David Aldridge. A look at Atlanta's opening lineup. In the backcourt, it's the Stars, Young, and Murray. Hunter's out there with Bogdanovich. And it's Capella in at the five spot. And for Chicago, we've got Alex Caruso. DeRozan out there with Vucevic. Then there's Dosumu, and it's White in at the point guard. These two teams are scheduled, Richard, to meet twice in a row, this being the first of those two. A chance to get very familiar with one another. I love these kind of mini playoff series you get in a season. It's a good opportunity to get some intel on your opponent. Now here's Murray. Good for the basket. Did Starting off Murray. one for one with that shot. Very smooth play by Murray. Working his way around the contact for the easy finish. DeRozan with it. Out guarded by Murray. And he gets the bucket. I tell you, he has some impressive moves in his repertoire. That's as good as it gets, but just one of many. Hunter against DeRozan. Young with no one around. Gets the three-pointer to fall. And how about the awareness Hunter possesses? Understands when one of his guys has an opportunity. Pass to Dosumu. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. Oh, yeah. For real. Come at us, and we're coming right back at you. Yeah, I love the competitive fire right there. You drain a triple on us, and I'm coming for my revenge. Yeah, Count that good. one. A solid mid-range shooter. Hunter knows where his strengths are. Right the pass to DeRozan. Down low, Vucevic. Whistle blows, bucket is good. He'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Easy possessions like that literally are just a gift. You just dream of them. He'll gladly take those. At the line for the Bulls, Nikola Vucevic. And Vucevic, RJ, one of the few NBA players from Switzerland. Yeah, he's in a pretty exclusive club of Swiss players. Just four players coming from there. All of them since 2006. I love it when we get new players from new countries. It just grows the game. How about the strength and focus on that one? It's clear Hunter up to the challenge at finishing on a physical defense. RJ, for the Bulls, it's been a struggle to find consistency the past few seasons. It's been a one step forward, one step back kind of situation. That they don't need Find to the set their sights Find on a the title lanes. yet. One they shot. just have to establish that winning culture. The free throw drops for Hunter. Since moving to Atlanta in 1968, Greg, the Hawks have never been to the NBA Finals. That is insane. Kevin. I mean, you think back to all the great players they've had from Dominique Wilkins to now Trey Young. Bucks fans are hungry for a trip to the finals. And how great are they playing? Four for four shooting to start this one. Here's Hunter. Down it goes for his third basket in as many tries. Awesome concentration there. When Hunter's committed to scoring, he's hard to stop. Just over two and a half minutes played here so far in the first quarter. And the basket by DeRozan. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. Yeah, when he gets engaged this early in the game, it's bad news for the defense. He can roll this start throughout the rest of the game. Now, here's Bogdanovich. One of the dependable scorers on the team. He's averaging close to 17 points a game. And the activity he shows around the rim it is why he is such a respected defender. Yeah, you can see why he's established that reputation. Strong understanding of how to defend at the rim. There's White following the basket by Trey Young. And the foul called on Io Dosumu. That is his first foul of the game. Yeah, really good defensive play to cut him off there and square up. 
so it's Bogdanovich who brings up the ball for the Hawks. Defeated by the Pacers in their last game, they'll try to put that one behind them. Yeah, I mean, on the road, their defense was just overrun. Couldn't match the intensity of the opponent, and it cost them. Yeah, if you allow a team to shoot such a high percentage in their own building, you're going to have a big hill to climb. And here is Hunter, following the three-pointer by DeMar DeRozan. Wide open look here for Murray, and he can't answer back the three-pointer offline. Chicago has gone two of two from three-point range here in the first quarter. The pass to Dosuma. Takes the three. It's hauled in by Clint Capella. And on an open look like that, he's very gifted at making the weak coverage pay. Even inside and against contact, Murray stays flexible and gets to his finish. Ball's not loose. Pass to Young. That's in there. Murray with the assist. Young's got seven. And really, it's been a major aspect of their offense in the early stages here. Their success working the ball inside and getting points from close range. And Capella sends it back. And quick off the floor, has that long reach. Capella there with the intimidation. Bogdanovich with it, out guarded by DeRozan. DeRozan against Bogdanovich. And it's Chicago with the rebound. A tough loss coming against New York in their last game play. And nowhere near at their best throughout the course of that game. A scrappy performance, but in the end, just not enough. You know when things aren't going your way, it's tough to stick it out. So I applaud them for hanging in there. Hunter kicks to Bogdanovich. Dishes it to Hunter. Six on the shot clock. Gets to the rim for two with the D all over him. He's got nine. Their interior has been inferior defensively. It has got to tighten up. White finds Caruso. Now here's Vucevic. No good with the triple. Shocking that he just bricked that one. The defense got real lucky there. Here's Young. And it's sent back by White. And I love seeing White use that athleticism on defense. Great hustle to swat that shot. Bulls moving the ball around. To the left wing. Here's Vucevic. Vucevic has got five now. I'll tell you what, I'm not sure these guys can keep this up. There will be some let down at some point. But these teams, they are built to score. So for three, Murray, and the three ball is good. And the Hawks lead by four. And the Bulls decide to take their first time out here. And when it comes to Kobe White, a young guard who shoots with assertiveness. Well, he's a guy that knows his role, Greg. And when he's out there, his teammates encourage him to shoot the ball because they know how hot he can get. Chicago are going with an almost entirely new group. Here. Andre Drummond's checked in for Vucevic. Torrey Craig comes in for DeMar DeRozan. Terry's checked in for Alex Caruso. And it's Carter in for Dosumer. Bruno Fernando's checked in for the Hawks. Matthews comes in for Bogdan Bogdanovich. A quality pass setting up a quality shot. It's just textbook basketball. to the basket. 
and foul Lincoln. on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. First way to attack foul. there and then create Second the contact. Foul. And guys, what do you think about the That's offensive the approach two. so far that we've seen for the Devon Hawks? Carter. The story so far has been their mid-range shooting. The analytics might not like it, but elite offenses still knock it down from that area. And also, guys, they're out-muscling their opponent. The points in the paint are piling up because of that aggressiveness. First free throw is good. Atlanta making a switch here. Lachey's checked in. And it's tied up with that one. And so it's Young who brings it up for the Hawks. Passes to Fernando. Kicks to Matthews. Young outside. Shot clock at six. Over Carter. A nice shot by Young. Young's got nine. Such a creative ball handler. Young has an ability to carve out room for himself with his dribble. White dishes to Terry. Carter against Young. Tries it from the top of the key, and he gets it to go. Hit off the back of the rim. Here's Young. Nine points in the game so far. Pass to Krejci. And here's Matthews. And the jumper West falls for Just outstanding distribution. This is the kind of team Vee chemistry that Krejci. you love to see. Carter, the pass to White. The pass to Craig. Shot clock at five. On the top of the key. They get it again. And Drummond throws it down. Pursues the offensive glass with purpose. Drummond knows who he is, and, and boy, does he attack it. And it's sent back by Drummond. Over in the corner, White. Back to Terry. Two minutes remaining in the first. Shoots from the line. Got a piece of it. Three on three. Feeds it to Matthews. There's the dish to Young. From 20 feet out, he squares up and sinks it. Young's got 11. And shooting-wise, he's been fantastic, helping to build this lead. Inside, Drummond. And Craig has it in the corner. Basket good. Craig's got it all tied up now for the Bulls. Rate of baskets assisted, it's a stat I really like. It tells the story of how well you are playing team offense. Stolen. He dishes it to Terry. Pass to Drummond. Score the basket, his second of two attempts. Breaking down some numbers here for the hustle. The bull. From the tip, they are not making things easy on them. Lots of steals playing disruptive basketball. And the other thing, I love how they're playing up tonight. Getting Radio. into ball handlers and forcing from some turnovers. Bruno Somebody Bruno. came to play tonight. Six out of his first seven. And it's Terry off the drive. Terry. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Terry's got his second bucket of the game to go. And Matthews kicks to Capella. Young against Carter. Out left to the wing. Passes it to Matthews. Shoots it. Nice spin off the left rim and in. And here's White. Shoots over Matthews. It's all tied in Chicago. The second quarter coming up right after this break, so don't go anywhere. 33, the Hawks, 33.
again, it's been a pretty even game here after one quarter of play. Looking at what we've seen for the Bulls, what do you guys think? Well, you can see these guys are unafraid to take chances defensively. Yeah, they're putting pressure on all the ball handlers, getting into the passing lanes and showing great anticipation. And so it's DeRozan. He'll bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. On the court for Atlanta, we've got Matthews. Bogdanovich out there with DeAndre Hunter. Then there's DeJounte Murray. And it's Fernando in at the five, patrolling the paint. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's DeRozan. No good there off the double clutch. You, you almost have to assume he's going to knock those down when he is that open. Murray, good. And, and they've worked the ball around so well tonight for those quality looks from mid -range. Now here's Caruso. He had a 15-point outing in their last game against the Knicks in New York. And in addition to putting up points, he terrorized ball handlers, racking up a ton of steals. Here is Matthews after the Bulls pick up two. Murray, good. Murray's got 11 points. He has no problem going in there with the big trees because Murray is focused on that possession. Terry with it. The shot is good, and so is his shooting tonight. Three for four. Here's the Hawks with the ball. And again, DeJounte Murray. Murray's got six here in this quarter. You got to give credit to Murray there for keeping his concentration in that moment, not allowing the D to throw him off a little bit. Bogdanovich against Caruso. Makes it off the glass. Caruso's got the game tied up here for Chicago. Hawks have got a nice 3 of 3 to start the set. Here's Murray. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. He's got 15. The heater now. He hasn't missed one this quarter yet. And for those of you just joining us, we're almost two and a half minutes into the second quarter. DeRozan, that's good. A rare three for DeMar DeRozan. He's a different type of wing. He would much rather step in and knock down the mid-range, too. Hunter finds Murray. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. You thought that first quarter was good? He's been even better in the second. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. And his average at the line stands at about 79% right now. So solid numbers in that department. Frank, you look at the size of some of these point guards now. Magic Johnson would feel right at home. Yeah, it's a part of a larger trend with all the switching defensively. If you have just one smaller guy on the floor, he is going to get targeted. For the short break in the action gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Well, DeJounte Murray grew up in South Seattle. He said a lot of stuff goes on. It was rough. But NBA veteran and fellow Rainier Beach graduate Jamal Murray tried to help him. Murray says he always stayed positive with me and my family. He'd say that kid has a chance. And every summer we play pickup. I knew I could be okay if I stayed working. Kevin? And he did. DA, thanks so much for the report. Hawks have gone a sensational 5 of 5 from the field since the start of the second quarter. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. And, and you know, few guys play their role better than Bogdanovich. And, and by that, I mean he's often exceeding expectations and giving his squad more than they asked him to. The first one falls. Carter, he's checked in for Dosuma. And so Bogdanovich nails both of them. And that's the norm for him. He's pretty much automatic when he's at the line. Pass to Caruso. Back to Carter. 
on the wing, DeRozan. Back to Carter. Fires from deep. And again, it's the Bulls from deep. You talked about a back and forth game. This is the definition. You have to love these kinds of games, scoring wise, keeping everybody on their toes. Murray, good. Just a great hustle play there. Energy and passion. This is what you play the game for. Here's Carter. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. And they got to bring the double team on. He's gone two for two at the line so far. Personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for the Bulls, Javon Carter. And so it's Murray with it. He brings it up for Atlanta. Trailing by two. Through the net again. He's done that ten times tonight. And he's only needed 11 shots to get there. From three points per game as a rookie to a night like tonight, Murray has molded himself into a primary scorer in this league. Beyond the leaning, you could see his feet more set on that screen. Easy call. Look, guys get away with this all the time, but on this occasion, he got caught. Now, here's Hunter. He's got nine. A three from Bogdanovich. Wow, through the contact, and that three almost went in, so he'll go to the line for three free throws. 13 foul. For Atlanta, they have looked good at the line. They're perfect in four attempts. Three shots. Three shots. Three shots. And he hits the first of three. He hits the second from the line. And they're really getting more points at the free throw line here in the second quarter. Nails the third. Bulls trail by three. Carter outside. He kicks two. DeRozan. That one is good. He's only missed one shot of his six taken on the floor. And the strength of DeRozan is evident on these takes. Shrugging off the fence. He's like it's absolutely nothing. They're not even there. Tell you what, RJ, in over a decade, all DeMar DeRozan has done is get better. Yeah, he's continuing to become a more efficient scorer. He's been a star. Multiple All-Star games, multiple All-NBA awards, and he's been doing it with different franchises as well. rebounds and two assists uh, to have a scorer like him consistently deliver you points makes such a big difference for a team he's someone you can rely on to bring it on a nightly basis when they need a basket he's the guy they turn to just his first attempt he hits the back iron and sinks the shot Fernando has got his first points of the night Carter against Murray 
Carter, the pass to Caruso. Back to Carter, lock at six. The tray, and the Bulls, another three. He's not their first option too often, but he can hit the three when he's on. There's the pass to Hunter. Dishes it to Matthews. The Hawks need to get off a shot here. Goes up the baseline, and he gets the friendly spin, and that one drops. And that's 11 points for DeAndre Hunter. Just focusing on the task at hand, that's all you can do. Yeah, when the game is up for grabs like this one has been, it's all about the attention to detail. And after struggling out the game, he's looked more confident. And it's why his teammates have continued to feed him. Murray kicks to Matthews. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. And they're passing the ball very crisply here. Outside to Rosen. Terry the pass to Caruso. And the Bulls another three. Well, guys, this first half has been about as tightly contested as you could hope for. There have been a lot of lead changes. Goodness. Now, here's Hunter. 11 points in the game. A three from Bogdanovich. Another three for Atlanta. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. This is today's NBA. Hey, we see this kind of exchange more often than not. They get it back. Count that one. Caruso's got it all tied up now for the Bulls. And boy, has he picked it up since the start of the second. His shots now starting to fall. Atlanta calls timeout. Every timeout, a chance to review the lineups, matchups, or call a play. I'm sure all of the above is in order, and you can never be too content. Checked in for Vucevic. Tory Craig comes in for DeMar DeRozan. And it's wide in for Javon Carter. Krejci passes to Young. Here's Krejci. Misses the three. Pass to Terry. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway. So a three-point play chance for him. And they repeatedly probed inside in the first half, guys. And, and it's paid off. Chicago shooting their sixth ball. attempt at the charity stripe in the game. Yeah, and looking the over their the percentage ball. on the season, Terry. I think they will be thrilled with the number in terms of their free throw percentage, 79. On the free throw, no good. And so it's Bogdanovich who brings up the ball for the Hawks. Trailing by two. And they're getting to the line a lot in this quarter, guys, and it hasn't been by accident. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Trey Young. Shooting two. And that one misses. And something you like about Young is how he forces an opponent's hand. He, he makes you adapt and, and not the other way around. And he sinks the second. Chicago is going to sublime four of four from three-point range since we've gotten in here in the second quarter. Pass to Caruso. Back to White from outside the arc. Another three for Chicago. And you have got to honor White. 
hitting on the perimeter. Once he gets comfortable from there, it's going to be bad news for the defense. Now, here's Hunter. 11 points in the game. And it's sent back by Drummond. Hunter against Gray. Now here's Terry. He's got 10. Six to shoot. And Capella sends it back. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. Now, let's take a look now at the stats for Bogdanovich. He's been in good form here the last few weeks. First in free throw percentage, and he's right up there in the top 20 in scoring. Certainly a force to be reckoned with offensively. And it's nice when you have the NBA's best free throw shooter just keep the ball in his hands in clutch situations. He's been completely automatic this season. Now here's Capella. Lob pass to Capella. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Young. And a chance here to check out some stats for Trey Young. The Bulls leading by four. Terry looking over the floor. That one is good again. He sits right from the floor with the basket. Used the pick to perfection and got all the way to the rim. Pass to Young. Capella dishes to Young. Count that as his Great seventh goal. field goal. Nine tries. He's shooting 78%. You know, fleshing out his attack a little more. Young showing more of a willingness to go in there amongst the trees. And again, Chicago turns it over. Ball. Let's take a look at the 2K leaderboard to find out who the best defenders have been over the past month. Here are your Steel's leaders. You take a look at Caruso. Such quick hands. Second in the NBA. And, of course, DeJounte Murray. This is another guy who can defend so very well. Such quick reflexes. Between these two guys, it's been quite a month of weavery. Just look at the steals for them over that period of time. White, good. White's got the lead up to six now for the Bulls. And of the last six baskets, five have come on the interior. This is just smash mouth physical basketball, guys. And he has been on fire this quarter in terms of his scoring. Hopefully, that fire spreads to his other guys and they can rally. Back to White. Rebound by the Hawks. Capella's got four rebounds now tonight. Young pass to Hunter. Shoots from 12. And he knocks down the jumper. And now, just a two-point Bulls lead. Uh, with a number of moves and shots to choose from, Hunter is scary. Nice bucket there. Bobbed up there for Drummond. Throws down the alley-oop slam. A huge target on alley-oops. Throw it towards Drummond, and he'll take care of the rest. And the basket by Krejci. Just a textbook lead pass right there, putting it right where it needed to be. Good for another basket. He's put up 10 shots and made seven of them. As hot as he's been this quarter, the game plan is simple, folks. Get him the ball and get out of the way. Here's Bogdanovich. He made that one. Basket number three for him. He's also missed two. And you have to admire Bogdanovich's confidence. Not easily shaken inside, even with the defense right up on him. Now here's White. 26 points for him last game against New York. And the pass to Craig. Pocket two. Terry, that's a two. Pulled the shot a little up, but the bounce goes his way. Terry's got 10 points now, just in this quarter. He can't get it to go. A big-time effort for Alex Caruso, providing a lot of energy for Chicago. He put together quite a quarter, 13 points in all, and he looks to be planning for more. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks, guys. With Quinn Snyder, coach, they came at you offensively. So what has to change for you defensively? Well, a lot, obviously, with everybody on the floor. Um, you know, they're capable of doing this, but we're not. It's just too easy. Got to tighten things up as we go along. Thanks for your time. Back to you guys. Thank you, David. We'll be back after halftime for the start of the second half momentarily.
It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. It is a good game we have here after one half of play. Everybody, welcome back for our halftime show. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, and Kenny Smith. It was a closely contested first quarter for Chicago. And they kept it close, trailing by, at the most, four points. They gained a little ground there in the second quarter. And Kenny, what did you think about what you saw from Chicago? The bench unit was an essential part of the puzzle in the first half. They really stepped it up in a big way, and that helped out. And now the starters can appreciate not having to carry the load on their own. And Shaq, how about what you saw from the Hawks? Right now, they're playing well only on one end of the court. All their energy has been spent on the offensive. And that's a shame. They're just going to keep giving up easy buckets, and the game's going to get away from them. And that wraps up the halftime show. Third quarter set to begin in just a few. On your big fans, it's time for your Chicago Lovable. And we've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. DeJounte Murray has been sensational. You just love the patience in that first half. Waited until he got the look he wanted. You love guys who can get their shots within the flow of the offense. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during the half. Torrey Craig is out there at the Rosen. Then it's White, and it's Vucevic, and it's Dosunmu in at the shooting guard position. So that's That'll the five in the game ball. for Chicago. DeRozan in Chicago with another bucket. And obviously his momentum from the last game has carried over here tonight. He's just riding the wave of momentum right now, getting to his spots and keeping things simple on the offensive side. Reggie, deep two from Murray. From the top of the key, he buries it. Murray's got 24 points. The release is getting so much quicker. Murray showcasing it there. And with an update from the sideline. Let's check in with David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. The Bulls lean in on their veteran core. Zach Levine said, you just got to be consistent every day and have championship habits. Each and every day, you've got to have a goal in mind and get to that mindset of, we're building for something. We've all sacrificed a little bit for the greater good. Kevin? And that's what we're talking about. That's what it takes. David, thanks. Here's Do Sunmu. Following the score by DeJounte Murray. Oh. Epic counts. Seven points for Dosumu. A clean start to the half for them, knocking down their first three shots. Got that one. The Bulls' Great lead man. has been cut to just five points on the basket from Young. And this game belongs to Young right now, and he is simply making everything. White with it, guarded by Murray. And DeJounte Murray gets the whistle that time. First personal foul. That's his first foul. First Alex foul. Caruso. He's checked in Seth for Chicago. The court. Wesley Matthews checked in for Atlanta. Two minutes into the second half of play now. And White kicks to Vucevic. No good on the triple. And the defense dodged one right there. Not the guy you want to leave open. That is good. And the Bulls lead is cut down now to just three on the bucket from Hunter. Their execution after halftime has been excellent, making their first four. On its way from DeRozan for two. Seven for nine now with that miss. Now shooting 78% from the floor. Hunter, the pass to Young. Now the dish to Matthews. Hunter against DeRozan. Five on the clock. On its way from Young for two. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. Wow. Five straight buckets coming out of half. Chicago timeout. Rolling. Chicago calls timeout. Yeah, trying to stem the tide here. On the wrong side of a scoring run here, we might it's see a line of change. I'll be pretty curious. On your feet and make some noise.
as we close in on the start of the playoffs. Of course, you know, the East is stacking up. They look at the Bulls. Right now, they're on the outside looking in at the playoff seats. And, of course, the Hawks. They're down there in the 10th spot. And right now for the Hawks, they're one of those teams that hasn't quite figured it out this year. A lot of talent, a lot of heart, but nothing to put them up on that next level. And you have to wonder if this roster can get to that next level. They have talent, but if it doesn't come together, they might have to shake it up. An assertive offensive player, White knows he has the green light to rise and fire. Young outside. Hunter dishes to Young. Over White. Count that one. The Bulls' lead has been cut down into a single point after the basket from Young. And I love the tenacity, guys. He simply can will his way into games at times and exert his presence. And it's hard to believe that the Bulls' offense only continues to get stronger. And in this one, he's really showing us what he can do. They timed up the layup perfectly. The D saw it develop and got there to bother the shot. Caruso, the pass to Dosunga. Now DeRosa. 19 points in the game. Here's Vucevic. Gets it to go from beyond the young. Vucevic has got his third basket of the night right there. It's almost like he had a bird's eye view of the court. DeRozan always knows where his teammates are. Murray scanning the floor, and the big shot is good. Murray's got six points in the quarter. And they're leaning on the mid-range right now. That's six of their last ten from that area. White bounce pass. Unloads from nine. Shoots a fader. Matthews with the rebound. When he's got the ball, those inside looks are usually money. Despite the miss, they should keep going to the And they're just through activity. Hunter keeps the pressure on the defense. What do you guys think so far about the offensive approach from Chicago? Look, they're getting good looks inside. It's been a point of emphasis all night long, but I love this hard-nosed attitude of this team. And also, guys, the confidence to keep taking the three. It's been falling. So they've got to keep going back to it. The free throw drops for Hunter. An athletic forward with, with a versatile skill set. Hunter has also proven he can come up big in big moments. Carter, he's checked in for White. Both free throws, good for Hunter. The Bulls have gone 6-9 from the floor here in the second half. They've got to be happy with that. The shot by Carter, nobody around. And the Bulls, another three. And perimeter scoring, I have to imagine it was a topic of discussion at halftime. And you see this so much more nowadays in the NBA. Teams putting a larger emphasis on jacking up threes. And the dunk by Capella. And the long arms of Capella using them to perfection as a target for his teammates on that alley-oop. For Alex Caruso, the, the advanced numbers say he is one of the best defenders in the league. The eye test backs that up. Caruso just sticks to guys, performs very well against the best guards in the game, is tremendous at anticipating sets, and shows his basketball IQ. And hard to miss the wide open man that time. Kudos to Young for finding him. Now here's Dosunu. He's covered by Murray. Shot clock at six. Here's DeRozan. Good for his ninth pick in just 12 shots. That's an even 75% shooting. Oh, man, he's feeling it this quarter. They should be looking to get him going every trip down the floor. Young outside. Hunter on the wing. And DeRozan sends it back. The experience of DeRozan is step back of the shooter. Andre Drummond's checked in for the Bulls. Terry comes in for Alex Caruso. And then for Atlanta, Bruno Fernando's checked in for Clint Capella. And it's Matthews in for Trey Young. 
Carter kicks to DeRozan. Knocks it loose. Back to Carter. Jacks up a three. Offensive rebound. Pass to Dosunu. Traps in the tray. Dosunu's got five points in the quarter. That's a guy you want taking shots. A quality offensive player. Passes to Fernando. Count that bucket. They didn't have much of a problem getting the ball into the post that time. And so it's Carter who brings the ball up for Chicago. Three-point lead. Here's DeRozan. He's got 21. Bob up there for Drummond. And Drummond throws it down. Just a clever play by DeRozan. Using the pick and roll to make space for someone else. Nice ball movement here by Atlanta. Here's Murray, and it's sent back by Drummond. And he's able to get it back. Murray, good. He's been a bright spot in their play today, but he could really use some help. Carter finds DeRozan. Rebound, Atlanta. Well, they'll be happy with that look, even though it didn't fall. Tough to watch those miss. I'm sure they'll convert the next chance. Now here's Murray. 30 points in the game. Fernando. And he goes in for the dunk. He's gotten so good at finding the open, and Murray does it again. Goes and dishes to Carter. Pass to Dosunmu. Over Matthews. Dosunmu shots good. Dosunmu's got seven points for the quarter. The Hawks trail by three. And here is Murray checking some stats on him right now. He's averaging just around 22 and a half points a game. Stolen by Terry. Knocked loose. And, and got to like what they've been doing down low in the post. Back to Murray. He's line J on the way. Again, the Hawks score. Check out the nice high release on Murray's jump shot. He's obviously been working hard on his shooting. Terry the pass to Dosunmu. Two minutes remaining in the Takes it inside, and he makes that one. Dosunmu's got 14 points. How about how he sets his man up there, runs him right into the screen, and then gets the basket. That is good. And the Bulls lead is cut to just one on the basket for Murray. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Here's Dosunmu, and he converts the late. Dosunmu's got 11 points here in just the second half. And he's had an excellent performance overall from the field. Atlanta calls timeout. But you're looking at Dosunmu. He's had some recent recognition for his ability. Getting to appear in the Rising Stars Challenge. Credit to the promise he shows as a young player. That selection can be very encouraging for a young guy. Second, so we'll bring up a list of shooting guards that have been red hot at the free throw line over the past month. Number one, Bogdan Bogdanovich. And one of the benefits of being as fantastic at the free throw line as he is, is it allows him to be really aggressive at driving the lane. Now, here's Bogdanovich. 12 points for him. Here's Carter. Count it and the foul. That's on DeAndre Hunter. And despite the size, this is attacking the heart of that defense. Really unfazed. Throw his height right out the window there. 
Bulls shooting their seventh attempt at the foul line in this one. Hawks making a switch here. Capella's checked in. Find the lane. No shot. And that one falls for Carter. The Hogs trail by six. Bogdanovich passes to Krejci. Hunter against DeRozan. Got it. And he's now eight of nine from the floor. And not relying at all on the three-point shot. Uh, they may want to rethink about stretching the defense a bit like they did in that first half. Now, here's Craig. Currently averaging almost six points a game. Just five on the clock. Popped up there for Drummond. An emphatic L.U. jam. And how about the movement there by Drummond off that pick and roll? Getting himself to a great spot there for the finish. Three seconds separate the shot clock and game clock. And there's the pass to Capella. And the shot goes down. Capella's got his second basket of the game. And so far in the second half, this has been a different kind of game than what we saw early on. And they look like a completely different team. I wonder what Coach said to them at halftime to help spark this momentum chain. And so it's DeMar DeRozan making highlights for the Bulls. They've leaned on him for offense, and he hasn't let him down. He's now up to 23 points today. We'll get right back to the action when we return. And now let's go back to a play from earlier as we show you our State Farm assist of the game. And, you know, you can always count on him for at least a couple of these pretty assists over the course of a game. And this one, a thing of beauty. And the ability to drop your jaw with the pass is something you rarely see in this league. What a talent he is. Three tenths quarters behind us. One more to go. Thanks for being with us as we begin the fourth. Fourth quarter on the court for the Hawks. Clint Capella is out there with DeAndre Hunt. Then there's Bogdanovich. And it's Young. And it's Krejci in at the two-guard spot. Here's Hunter. Here's Capella. And he uses the glass on the lane. Capella's got the fourth quarter going with the first basket of the period here for the Hawks. Right the pass to Dosun. grabs the miss and here's Hunter he'll bring it up for Atlanta four-point game here's Bogdanovich and that one clearly a foul gets the whistle and two shots coming up and I want to see more of this Bogdan getting assertive and just forcing his will on the deep Bogdan Bogdanovich taking two shots throw good Bogdanovich and so he makes both from the line a little over a minute of the fourth quarter gone right now to Caruso. Drives to the hoop. And Capella sends it back. And it's Bogdanovich in the corner. Here's Krejci. Five to shoot. The bucket is good. He'll have a chance for one more. That one on Vucevic. Oh, I, I think no. He had the crossover in his bag of tricks. Now I've seen it all. Vite Krejci. Now 
Now the free throw is good. Now leading by one. Here's White. Passes it to Dosuma. Now Craig. The shot's good. Boy, right down to the wire here. Still anyone's ball game. Yeah, and after all the energy both sides have expended, both teams still hungry for the win. Here's Krejci. Pocket six. And the Hawks getting another basket right there. Krejci. You love how each side has risen to the challenge throughout this one. Man, this has been a fun one. Look, who doesn't love a high-scoring game? Caruso, the pass to Vucevic. And the shot goes in. And the Bulls lead by one. From not stopping Vucevic that time, powering through the defenders. Pass to Krejci. And really just a great play to sacrifice his body and take the charge. And that Second is an absolute ball. heartbreaker of a turnover. In a close the floor, game like this, ball. that might be enough to Joe impact ball. how it Joe ends. DeMar DeRozan, he's checked in for the Bulls. Like the pass to Dosuna. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Second That's on foul. Clint Capella. First foul. At the line for Chicago. I am just Zulu. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. The free throw drops for Dosumu. He's perfect from the line this time. The Hawks trail by three. Here's Krejci. From down in the low post, it goes. And so far in the second half, this has been a different kind of game than what we saw early on. And they look like a completely different team. I wonder what Coach said to them at halftime to help spark this momentum change. Kicks it to Young. Yep, that one goes. Young's got 24 points. All right, well, look at how the hustle game has been going for the Hawks. All you have to do is look at one stat, and that is their block numbers. It tells you how tight their team has been. They've been going out of their way to smother the defense. And also, guys, they've been showing how dangerous they are in the open floor. When they see a chance to get easy points, boy, they just jump at it. Wesley Matthews checked in for Atlanta. Capella finds Hunter. DeMar and the whistle DeRozan. blows. It's going to be on DeMar DeRozan. Personal foul. And that'll be his third foul so far. Foul. And still early in the period, and they're only one foul away from being over the limit. Hunter on the wing. Fires it up. Oh, and that one had the Deion right spin Drake on it, and it is good. And it's a three-point Hawks lead. And White gets to DeRozan. Over Hunter. DeRozan. That's good. 25 points in the game. And that's right in his wheelhouse, looking to make an impact when it counts. And his team needs every bit of his production if they want to pull this one out. It is neck and neck here in the final period. Six on the shot clock. Here's Young. Again, the Hawks squid for two. And that set them apart today, guys. Their success with the mid-range. Dosunu, the pass to DeRozan. He kicks to Vucevic. Good. And it's DeRozan picking up the assists. DeRozan's got his fourth assist in this one. Now the pass to Hunter. He makes his 10th basket of the night for the field. He has missed two shots from the floor. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Right the pass to Dosunu. 
Three-pointer. And again, it's the Bulls from deep. Having a lot of trouble stopping the three-point shot. Young with the ball. Bob pass to Capella. Up high to stop the alley-oop. And this is the effort you want to see out of your guys, win or lose. You can't question the desire of these teams. It's going to be difficult for either side to get separation. Caruso goes up and lays it nice and easy. And the Bulls lead by one. Selfless player, Vucevic finding his man all alone. White against Young. Capella inside. That one good for two. Capella. Capella's got six in the quarter. Yeah, love the job they're doing here of getting into the teeth of that defense. Here's DeRozan, and he drops it in from the low post. And just running the offense. White's that new breed of combo guard who can do a little bit of everything. Atlanta calls timeout. You gotta like what DeMar DeRozan has done in this game. Well, he's been destroying them inside. And they need a timeout to figure out an answer or a prayer if there is one. DeMar DeRozan. Yeah, and his performance has been a jaw dropper. He must have been feeling great coming into the building tonight. Because once he hit the court, it was all working for him. He was in a zone. Chicago making a switch here. Carter's checked in. And the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Hey, Kevin. Well, during the last break, I heard Quinn Snyder talking with his team. Now it's a close one. So Green. coach asked I'm his out, team out. to keep their focus. He said this game's going to come down to mistakes. If we play clean, we'll win. Great game tonight. Let's see how it winds up. Guys. Okay, David, much appreciated. Time out call. The Bull. DeRozan, he'll bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. Pass the cart. Here's Dosunu. He's covered by Murray. DeRozan passes to Vucevic. Good. And it's DeRozan picking up the assists. DeRozan's got six assists here tonight. This is it to Capella. Hunter against DeRozan. Hunter, the pass to Capella. It falls for the sixth time in seven tries this contest. That's 86%. That's the 10th straight point they've given up in the paint. And it's Carter penetrating, and Capella sends it back. And that's out of bounds. Chicago will retain possession. Get up, get up, get up. 
Caruso looking for an opening. And stolen by Murray. Lob pass to Capella. And out of bounds is Chicago Games possession. That pass wandered off target. Can't lose focus on the little bitty things. Chicago trailing here. Now here's Dosumu. Outside DeRozan. Chalk up two there. DeRozan's got 17 now, just in the second half. He plays the game in so many different ways. DeMar DeRozan getting it done here with some nice handles. Got that bucket in and no time at all. And the Hawks lead by one. He's been dominant all game long. Nobody on the floor can stop him. And look, let's just say he knows it. Here's DeRozan. Uses the glass to finish the way. DeRozan's got eight points in the quarter. There are guys that can take that shot, and there are guys that can make that shot. DeRozan loves having the ball in these big moments because he understands how to deliver. And he's coming up big here in the clutch. Chicago calls timeout. It's been quite a game for DeJounte Murray. Okay, I'm going to take you guys inside the huddle, all right? The message from Coach is simple. Stop and feet fans, make some noise. It's time for T-shirts. Scanning the floor. Shoots from the elbow. It's Chicago with another bucket. That's his bread and butter, DeRozan. One of the great mid-range shooters in this game. Young drives in, and the layup's good off the glass. Young's got 17 now, just in the second half. Game tightening up, no problem. Put the ball in Young's hand and let the young fella go to work. Third personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for the Bulls, Jamal DeRozan. Shooting two. And the first one drops. I like the leadership DeMar DeRozan provides for his team. He's a steady veteran presence out there on that floor. He can motivate his guys even in really tough moments. Both free throws good from DeRozan. In a tight game, he is exactly who he wanted at the line. 11 feet away. By Carter, and they're able to recover. Young left side. Shot clock at six. A second chance effort, and again it's Atlanta. Young. Right there, you, you see it. Young's ability to operate out of that pick and roll, very advanced for a player of his age. DeAndre Hunter, third personal foul, third team foul. At the line for Chicago. Jamal DeRozan. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. It's the first. That narrows the gap to one. Well, DeRozan is a high percentage free throw shooter. He just has to get the job done here.
And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Certainly some pressure on those free throws. Still delivered. Young outside. Bob Bass to Capella. And the dunk by Capella. What an important Great possession. Up. Capella's been in that situation many times before. And he knows the drill. To Rosen. That's good. DeRozan's got 39. The veteran leader of this squad, DeMar DeRozan, showing the kids how it's done down the stretch. And Great there it is for him. And the Hawks lead by two. So calm when the game is on the line. Young knows it's his job to bring this game home. And the shot goes in. Oh, you just love seeing a player with absolutely no fear. He knew what they needed here and was determined to deliver. Young with the ball. Now guarded by Vucevic. Good. Young. And look at how quick he was to bite on the pump fake. Left his feet way too soon. Carter against Young. From 15 feet away. It's in. He has tied up this game. Oh, what a shot. Nice play by DeRozan. Yeah, such a strong home score. So consistent in his approach at the offensive end. Now a timeout called by Atlanta. We've got 28 seconds left in the fourth. Young pass to Capella. Yes! Timeout, timeout. And they do have a foul to give. Training. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. Timeout for the Bulls. They trail by two. 23 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Guys, what do you think? Big chance here to tie it with a bucket. And you also have to wonder if they'll try for a three. But they'll probably try for a two. But if something opens up outside, I doubt that they will hesitate to take it. DeRozan. And there's the drive. He dishes it to Carter. DeRozan again. Hunter shoots. Can't cash in. Okay, they came Shoot close the there to tying it up. The intensity out there right now. Close game. Both teams leaving it all out foul. there. Time call here. The Hawks decide to the talk Hawks it over. Call They're ahead by two. Six seconds left here in the fourth quarter.
six seconds left in the game. Not watching the line there. That'll be a backcourt violation. And stolen by Hunter. And so they choose to intentionally foul. Yeah, you, you have to do that, though. You can't just let him dribble the game. 15 foul. Shooting for Atlanta. DeAndre Hunter. Two shots. So the first one drops, and that makes it a three-point lead. So he gets them both, and it's a four-point ballgame. Calm and cool, and his free throw put a bow on this one. Nice way to finish the game up. And so it's the Hawks who That's come out on top. This was a hard-fought, well-earned victory for him, Greg. They really <laughs> had to Thank work you. for this win. That's a good point. I mean, we could see this might have fucked at the end. The crowd amped up, up. everyone in the building kind of rooting against you. But they stood tall and, and pulled it out. Well said. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Kevin, thank you. Trey, this is a young team. So what is the chemistry and connection that lets you play together so well? Uh, I mean, you, you're around us outside of the locker room. I mean, you can tell why we, why we support each other so well and the energy we have for each other on the court. I mean, it, you can tell the reason why we do that. And uh, I mean, I love this group. Well, congrats on the win, man. Appreciate your time. Kevin? Thank you, David. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. This is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for tuning in. We'll see you later.